it's me Milkbread and today I'm going to be showing you how to ace online classes. So before we get started, there is something different about this video and it's because I'm speaking. And I will be speaking in my videos from now on because it will help me to gain my confidence and not go gibberish in public if I speak to anyone. So please enjoy this journey and also please enjoy this video. So this is one of the most important tips in the video. Of course there are many, or a few, but this tip is to engage in lesson and also listen to your teachers. By doing that you're able to understand what you're doing in terms of extra work or independent tasks, and also it will help the teacher to not Think that you're going downstairs or anywhere else for a cup of tea or you're playing video games while doing anything else therefore it's better for you to engage in lesson and it's going to be good for your report as well and another thing that you could do is to type down the answers if you have a chat function in your live lesson class thingy and that will help the teacher to know that you are there and that you are concentrating and it is good for you to concentrate in online classes because you're missing out a lot of work in physical school let me ask you a question how many of you have multitasked while doing a piece of work or being in an online class i have so I am quite guilty about it, but I have to try stopping that, and I'm going to help you stop it as well. So with multitasking, psychologically people think that, they're able, that they are good at multitasking, but turns out they aren't because they're more prioritised on the work that's more fun, the work that has more dopamine, like dopamine, something that's more exciting than doing a piece of work unless you like work but for human beings we usually like fun things i'm not roasting you people who like work but it's just it's kind of difficult to avoid a distraction even though you're being distracted so my tip for you is to find an app which can block apps kind of weird but there are some apps that do that while you're doing productive work. One includes Forest, another one, Fauna or Fauna, I can't pronounce it. But Forest is paid, but Fauna is free, but I think you need Messenger to sign up or something. And if you have an iOS platform device or a Mac, then screen time works. But unfortunately, I don't know any apps or anything about Android or Windows screen times or app blocking things. So if you have an Android or a Windows device and you know what it is, then comment down below and then I'll try pin your comment down when I'm available. If you're doing the work set in class in a good standard, congratulations, feel free to skip this point, but if you're not, then I suggest you change your ways and do it now, but not literally now, I'm not finished yet. If you don't do the work that's been set, then one you'll be well behind when you're back at school and the other, if your exams have got cancelled, then it counts towards your final grades, so it's very vital that you do the work set, meet the deadlines, and if you need any help, email your teacher and that way they'll try to help you as much as possible. In my school we don't really have to do peers in online class because there's not much of a point, of course. So we have this one hour window, but you can do something productive, maybe have a walk, play in the snow if your country has snow, do some exercise because it's pee of course. But here is a clip. You're a scary young person. The tributary ends about then. I think the first turn is the week. I 
I've got some extra snow. Sprinkle sprinkles. So the previous clip was a snow day and it was quite fun. However, if you don't want to do any of these things, why don't you just start revising? Plus it will help you to go on track. Maybe make some revision cards or use Quizlet. It has many games. It has cards available for you. So why not try it? It's cool. So the next tip is an exclusive yet special tip, though it's not about online classes, it's about having your mind to be clear. So enjoy! Hey, how did that get in there? Sorry, wrong clip. <gasps> So here's the actual clip other than the Rick roll, and it's to clean your room. So you see I'm a local slob, right? So, which means that I should clean my room. And if you clean your room, then your mind becomes clear and away from all the clutter. And you can concentrate really well if you're revising, you're in online school, or you're just drawing or doing any other random sort of thing. And... It just looks clean, instead of your room looking like a dumpster. You, I'm, I'm not roasting you, again. But anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, um, comment down below what other videos I should do. Please like, please subscribe, though that's kind of weird to say. And... Happy online schooling!